<laughs> I got this thing. This this whole front splitter did fit. Carbon fiber from Extreme Online Store. Install a couple of goodies today on the Toyota Supra. Brand new, fresh carbon fiber front splitter and a rear spoiler for the new Supra. I'm excited. Extreme Online Store, guys. Go check out the links in the video description if you like what you see here. Carbon. That's gonna look so freaking fire. Already pre-drilled. Good stuff, man. So we're gonna dress up the front of our 2022 Toyota Supra. See that he's been busy at work on his. Got the new, uh, what kind of wheels are those again? Apex wheels. Got the spoiler on the back. Got the single exit exhaust looking good. Yeah. I remember when you left my heat gun and stuff over here. So I was like, man, we got to come over here to do it. Yeah. ASC window tinting in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Joey, my buddy, he's the only one that I let tent my windows on any car that i have and it looks absolutely stunning so job well done asc window tinting again links in description for the way that this looks but yeah much better of course when we're done we'll get it out into the sunlight let's get started all right yeah let's check this out it's yeah, a nice carbon weave here so we're gonna have to apply some 3m tape on the back of it these things are super easy to install so i highly recommend joey and his service over there like second to none honestly but extreme online store also go check out the links for whatever you see in this video if you are interested because it's good high quality carbon fiber and it does not break the bank Ooh, look at that dude check that out so we're just kind of sitting on the car right now uh we are going to measure before we stick into the car obviously measure 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 and then stick because you know once it's on it's kind of on oh my gosh on the camera it looks so good this might be my thumbnail right here Dude. Look at that on video, brother. I've never seen an app like that. Yeah, it's on your phone. It comes with it. What? Yes. Now Hold we're on. at three inch over here and two and a half over there. So, so we got it. And you went from here to like not right there, right? Yeah, from here to here and from there to there on the other side. Did I leave my tape measure over here? I did? Yeah. Crap. Yeah, you just go to measure. Look, go to your app. Yeah. And go to measure and boom, and you can measure it. It's I like, never, never knew that. Look, let's see. Seven inches. Bro, I never knew that on iPhone. <laughs> 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 that's kind of sick though obviously i'm not going to just use that as judgment i'm going to try to we'll get some tape up here and and do it that way too just to confirm but that looks good though once we actually stick it down i like this yeah dude it's a little more subtle but looks really good freaking fire Uh, measure tape is I don't know where so we're using the tape and some marker and uh, also a little phone app that he got to kind of get us visually in the right area I think but as you slide it in the curvature of the the metal on the car it kind of just kind of fits in there so you can get it pretty close we're gonna continue with this till we get it just perfect and then we're gonna stick it have it installed and it looks freaking so good like we saw in the beginning we were laying it i really like how it kind of just accentuates the top you still get the hips it's got a really really killer look to it i'm digging it but we're going to check out the front splitter now and this one's cool because it's already pre-drilled kind of like we picked up in the beginning but let's go ahead and open it up and check this bad boy out so they give you all the hardware that you need looks freaking good already pre-drilled and it's going to kind of give it a uh, a cool look i think there's a bunch of different options on the internet but this is one that i think that looked one of the hottest so let's get it installed on the car it's already pre-drilled should be pretty easy and we're just going to breeze through it and then we'll show you the after of how everything looks let's get going <laughs> Look at that lighting oh, right yeah, there. Dude. dude, that's killer lighting. Hold on a second, I gotta see the difference. iPhone 14 Pro iPhone. versus a 13. Dude, yeah, look. Oh yeah, massive camera difference. Like, that's dark and bright. That's freaking crazy. That's a huge difference. Yeah, so iPhone 14 Pro, worth the upgrade I guess, but hey, check it out. So we got it done. I gotta dust it off and wipe it down, but easy install man well, there's a couple of videos on, on youtube with these 
We did skip the installation because there is no instructions, but it's honestly pretty easy. So he uses some factory uh, hardware and then you have the self tappers and it's self explanatory the way that it bolts up to the car. Honestly, we did it in what, 20 minutes? Mm -hmm. And uh, so we got a bunch of reinforced uh, bolts down here plus the factory stuff, but it's not going anywhere. What's cool is some of the other videos on this don't show what's inside. You know, it looks like, cause that was my question too. I was wondering, I was like, does it actually, is this like a hole? But it actually allows air to pass through. So, which is pretty freaking cool. So it's functional. So could this actually be like a, you know, a performance piece other than just cosmetic and actually add downforce? Maybe. So we didn't lose a lot of, I don't think height. Still got a lot of ground clearance, I think. So uh, still factory suspension, but I am in love with it. What do you think? It looks really good, yeah. honestly. So, do have discount codes for all of these parts. Check out the video descriptions, save some money. I like to be able to save you guys some money, so check them out, but. Uh -huh. Now you just need to add a little something, something right here. They do make the carbon fiber side splitters, side skirts and then also the rear diffuser pieces as well. Where's the rear diffuser pieces go? So, different options, but kind of the, the, a little small lip back here. They have uh, different options on the website. All right, yeah, man, this is really, really delicious looking. It just kind of sticks up in the back just a little bit. I am digging this look. That front splitter, a little bit of carbon on this color. This is turbulence gray, and it looks right at home. Need to get some carbon mirror caps. Maybe the uh, side splitters here, side skirts. And uh, yeah, it's gonna really set it off. So good job, Joey, on the window tent to ASC window tent in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Looks really good. What's that? It's even more aggressive on the front now. Yeah, it looks, it looks, <laughs> it looks so good. I am in love. This is a bright camera, dude. dude this, new, this new iPhone, bro. I'm, I'm livid. I need to get one now because Oh, I see the new watch. Well, when it's missing, you know, tomorrow, I know that you thefted it in the middle of the night. <laughs> but I could probably take it off in about five minutes and then just slip it on there real quick. But yeah. I have to call you to hold it up for me. So. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a shot right there. That's a money shot. That freaking spoiler in the back looks so good. Did you take your headlights? No, I did not. Oh, yeah. Look at that right there. That booty shot. Mmm! Mmm, that looks good.